Hi, this is Dudung Ditun and welcome to my channel. Gusto mo ba ng malaking smart TV pero sobra nitong mahal? You might wanna consider this before you buy. Kaya wag na nating patagalin. Pasok intro! The reason why I made this review is just because I always wanted to have a huge TV. But due to budget issue, lagi na lang siyang nede-delay. Until I reconsider buying a projector. I searched in Lazada and Shopee, and most of the results led me to Mirval na brand. Ito yung reason kung bakit ginawa ko tong review na to is just because sa dinami-dami ng models ng Mirval, I may say pare-pareho sila ng muka, magkakaiba lang sila sa specs, and especially sa presyo. And to tell you honestly, as a consumer, hindi siya nakakatuwa. Alam mo yung feeling na wala kang makita na maayos na review and you left at no choice but purchasing the device and you all depend on the reviews on the online shopping. I don't want to prolong the agony. Here it is, Mirval A9 Mini Projector. Guys, there's nothing special about the box. Plain lang siya na block na box. Seeing the device itself, it looks decent but I thought malaki siya. Plastic naman siya pero hindi naman siya mukhang plastic, mukha naman siyang tatagal. Yung mga nagustuhan ko dito sa projector na to is that number one, with Android system, Android 9, and based on experience, wala naman siyang lag. Number two, is my USB and HDMI port. Number three is my Keystone correction. Number four is my built-in YouTube, Netflix, and Play Store. May AirPlay and screen mirroring din. My Wi-Fi and also supports 5.1 connectivity. Number seven, my Bluetooth and my built-in speaker. Yung mga hindi ko nagustuhan. Number one, manual Keystone correction. Kasi po, once na enough mo yung projector, ina-adjust ko siya every time. Iba pa rin talaga kapag may auto auto keystone correction. Number two is the apology letter. When I spoke to the seller from China, they never mentioned about the Netflix does not run through an app but only to a web-based platform. Yun lang naman yung laman ng letter. At hindi rin naman ako nagreklamo kasi madali ko rin naman na solusyonan yung issue. What I did is I bought this remote and it runs smoothly naman. Number three, maliwanag naman siya kapag madilim. But I may say, hindi siya pwedeng pang umaga or dun sa room na maraming bintana. Number four, is mahina yung speaker. Well, I don't expect na maganda yung output ng speaker. Ano pa naman ang ina-expect natin na maliit lang din naman tong projector? Since may Bluetooth capability naman tong projector na to, what I did is I connected to my 5.1 speaker para cinematic pa rin yung output. For me, sa presyong 5,200, the time na ginagawa ko tong video, I will give it at least 8 out of 10 stars. 50,000 hours naman yung lifespan, so more or less magagamit ko siya 5 to 6 years. And hindi naman kami nanunood ng TV, este projector 24 hours. Panggabi lang talaga kami nagsistream. I decided to go for a projector kasi hindi naman kami nagsistream in the morning kasi nagtatrabaho kami. Pero depende lang din yan sa what matters sa inyo. Guys, I have not tried other models ng Mirval. Pero, Mirval, baka naman. Madali naman akong kausap. Baka naman. And I think that's it for now. I hope nakatulong tong video na to. If you have questions and suggestions, please don't hesitate to comment, hit the like and subscribe button, and also the notification bell for you to be updated on my next upload. See you soon on my next video. And once again, this is Dudong Ditun na nagiiwan ng kasabihang stay safe and always stay awesome. Bye!